You can have a DeepSeek model answer a question about any website on the internet. The setup is quite simple. We're going to start with a Firecrawl Scrape API component, and this is a component available in Langflow. You can either look in the bundles and Firecrawl is available. There are two different types. We're going to use the Scrape API. Another easy way to find this component is searching in the search bar here. And then basically we're going to drag and drop, we're going to add the API keys and Firecrawl has a free tier of API. So you can bring in API key and pretty much use it for free for quite some time. And now we're going to provide the docs for length flow and then have some sort of timeout setting. This is the default. So I left it as is and quickly to test if this works, we can hit this play sign and this is going to run the component. And once we run the component, we can see that there is some data available. So we can see it as a markdown. And if we were to click here, we can see what was pulled from the docs for Langflow website. And this is what we are going to pass to the next component, which is basically taking the data available from Firecrawl, converting it to a message, and we're passing that message over to a prompt template. And in this case, we're saying that just answer based on the following context. And the context is what we got from Firecrawl. Great. So with that context and the instruction, we are passing that over to the DeepSeek based model deployed on Grok. So if you have a free account with Grok, you can easily bring in your API key and then select the DeepSeek model. And with that, you can run this whole setup and you're going to get some messages out. And I have attached the chat input and chat output components here. And with that, I can open the playground and start asking questions. So here I asked, what is Langflow? So it's going to go through the documentation. It's going to go through the available context and it's going to answer based on that. And you can read through some of the thinking process and you'll notice that there is some context provided and it is thinking based on that context. And at the end, it's going to formulate the answer for you and then provide the response. So this is the DeepSeek R1 model, which is reasoning based model. And it is going to reason based on any of the questions you ask. Now, this is for one website. You can definitely scale this to multiple websites. And the setup is quite simple. It'll take a minute or so. And you can start asking questions or scraping different websites and answer questions you might have about those websites.